In the 1800s, John Barry and Mary Meacham ran a school for St. Louis's black residents. They called it the Candle Tallow School. It was in a church basement. They worked by candlelight because it had to remain secret. But when authorities found out, it was shut down. Soon after, a state law made it illegal to provide education to any of Missouri's black residents. So they came up with a plan to work around that law. The Mississippi River was federal property and not subject to Missouri's state laws. So they took a steamboat out to the sandbar in the Mississippi River, anchored it there, and operated a school. It was called the Floating Freedom School, and it operated for years. Each morning, ferries would carry students to the middle of the river, where they would receive an education. One of the students from the Floating Freedom School actually went on to co-found the Lincoln Institute, which is the oldest black college in Missouri. So John and Mary Meacham's influence still extends today.